Jeff, in previous videos, we kind of talked about employee engagement, and I believe that the Supporting Knights Institute is all about employee engagement. So what can companies do to increase employee engagement and why it's important these days? Yes, I mean, the first thing I always do is, you know, maybe I'll, I'll, I'll try this as you hear, like, it'd be cool to get people to say what they think engagement is. So when I say engagement, what do you think of as engagement? Uh, in my opinion, it's like you are engaged in your work, you love your work, and you're able to reach those targets because majority of our times we are in our workplace and it's kind of a second home for us. So we need to be able to have those deep and honest and authentic relationship and communication with coworkers, supervisors, so that it's not just like I'm here just for work. I'm here, my whole self is there for the work. Amazing. And so, yeah, I mean, a lot of research shows that there's three elements. So one is the one that you talked about, but you, you actually hit on a couple. Um, so you have to like your job. That's definitely part of it. Or at least the work you're doing needs to be at least somewhat motivating to you. Um, and that could be the work itself now, or it could be that it's taking you somewhere. But so, so there's engagement in your work. Um, the other thing that the research shows is that it's uh, people definitely will be growing. So there's some sort of professional and personal development People need to feel like they are thriving personally. They're growing. They're in a fertile environment. And then the final one is we need to be achieving meaningful goals. And so if all three of those are in place, you're going to have high, high engagement. If any one of them increase, um, you'll have an increase in engagement, even if it goes from low engagement to just a little bit higher. So, for example, if you're in a, a, a really toxic environment, but the company starts hitting really amazing goals, that's actually going to lift engagement. There's still going to be lots to do, so it won't be like really high engagement, but you'll see it move forward. So the key is to try to move all three of those things forward. And one of the initiatives we're doing right now that I think people might find interesting is we're partnered with um, Adler University. And one of the things we're doing is we have an engagement survey. Um, we're running it publicly right now. We need to get 200 respondents to fill it out. And then as part of the offer for that, what we're going to do is from the data we get back, we're actually cross-referencing our data with um, some proven methods. And we're going to offer people a webinar back to, to, that goes through employee engagement, our survey, and really kind of gets into some of the topics in a little bit of depth. So um, I can give you a link to that survey if you wanted to put it in the chat. I think people find that to be a cool exercise. Yeah. Thank you for that offer, Jeff, because I feel that a lot of companies here in Vancouver are talking about employee engagement, are talking about uh, having a meaningful, a purposeful life, because you need to have a, in a you will need to work in a company that you feel that you're making an impact and it's aligned with your personal values and that will help you motivate and flourish in your job. So, mm -hmm. so thank you for that. And I will put the link in the video. So for the audience, uh, please share this video so that other people will benefit from this uh, opportunity that Jeff is giving to us. Uh, like and share, uh, subscribe to the channel and tune in next time for another question with Jeff.